Welcome to Homemade, Homemade Habits. Habits. I'm Katie. I'm Nazo. And this is our very first challenge we're going to be doing for ourselves. So come along with us for the journey. So a couple of weeks ago, we watched this video by Michael Pollan, a well-renowned author, and he had this great idea about learning to become healthier. And he said, essentially, eat whatever you want, just make it yourself. So we've decided to follow that rule and create a challenge for ourselves, a six-week challenge in which we are going to eat whatever we want, but make it. And we have a few rules for this challenge, too. Before we get into the rules of the challenge, we want to talk about what our inspiration for it is and like what we're hoping to get out of it. So first of all, we have three sons, five-year-old and two-year-old twins. And every time we go out in public with our whole family, we hear... You should have your hands full. Yeah, so everyone just sees us and says that, and it's true. And, and because we are very busy as parents and as individuals who work and all the many things in life that come up, we have actually like fallen into some lazy habits with our family, with especially around eating. Mm -hmm. And, you know, we just throw in the frozen pizza or just whatever is kind of the easiest thing and generally not the healthiest thing. And... You and I, like, I've really noticed my energy levels have been kind of zapped. Well, and I can't, I can't play with them with the amount of energy that they, well, demand, really. So we've just been a bit too tired in general. And then for me in particular, the hardest thing is, like, I stepped on the scale recently, and I weigh more than I weighed at the height of my twin pregnancy. So, you know, nine months pregnant with twins, seven pounds her baby <laughs> and I weigh more now so that was really disheartening and you know I've tried these different diets and stuff lately and it's it's hard to stay motivated with really restricted diets for myself and so you know we, we saw this video and we thought well what if we just try this and the idea behind this concept is that if you are cooking everything yourself, then the foods that aren't that good for you will take a lot longer, they take a lot more work, um, and you'll find yourself making them less often and having healthier foods more yeah. regularly. The main comparison that I remember he made was about like fast food fries. And you know, you just go through the window, it's super cheap, you get the fries. If you're making French fries at home, you have to peel them yourselves, cut them yourself, uh, do all, you know, all the steps that, well, we have an air fryer, so we do this once in a while and they're actually yeah. really good, way less oil when we use an air fryer. And, you know, versus fast food, like you just grab it and if you're doing it at home. Well, it still it takes like over an hour. Yes, it takes all this time and then it's really delicious, but you're not going to be doing that like every day or even every week necessarily. So we're calling this the homemade cooking challenge. So it's a six week challenge and the rules are fairly simple. We have to make everything we eat and that means to, to us, that means as, as from scratch as possible. So that includes things like sauces, that includes like, it's not like, oh, I'm pulling out cookie dough and I'm making it, like I'm making cookies from scratch. So what we decided is like kind of the line is just as little processing as possible. Mm -hmm. So if there's, you know, mayonnaise that's already made, we're, we're going to say, no, that's, that's too much. All the ingredients, all the preservatives are in there, but we can make our own mayonnaise and then use that on a sandwich. And this even includes bread, which I'm yeah. kind of excited about because I actually really like baking <laughs> and I've experimented with a few recipes. So I'm excited to make some bread. So in addition to our physical and mental well-being and improvement, hopefully through this challenge, we're hoping that we'll actually get some more family bonding time um, by doing these uh, uh, you know, meals together with our kids. Hopefully they'll be more involved in the process. We'll I'm get some yeah, we'll get some experiences with them cooking, uh, cleaning. Oh, the cleaning would be great. <laughs> they could help with that. Uh, and overall, I'm, I'm personally hoping that meal prep will just be a little bit easier with everyone involved instead of it falling to just one person who's responsible for what everyone wants to eat and everyone usually has, you know, a different preference. 
So it's gonna be that, a family. It's gonna be a family task. Like we're gonna meal plan together and yeah. see where we can get the kids involved, and it'll be fun. It'll be a little messy, probably a little messy. Very messy. <laughs> it's three boys. That's okay. <laughs> so as we go through this challenge, we're going to be doing updates throughout. So we'll be doing a big weekly update, kind of like this one. And then we'll be doing videos throughout the week, uh, showing some of our recipes we're trying, showing updates, maybe showing what our kitchen looks like after having our three <laughs> young boys help. I'm a little nervous. <laughs> and on the main videos, we'll be sharing three main metrics for if we feel like we're doing better and feeling better. So the first one is energy, which we will rate on one to 10. So one being, I feel like a zombie and 10 being, I am ready to run a marathon. <laughs> and uh, I, will, I will say my start out one, my kind of baseline one is about a three. Yeah, I'd say a four for me. Okay. Yeah. Uh, I will share if I have lost any weight. He doesn't really need to. <laughs> lose weight right now but I'll just share uh you know if, if if that part is happening every week and we'll also do a little family bonding update and share how that's going so if you'd like to come along on our journey during this six week challenge please subscribe like this video and we'll keep you tuned and we have a free printable guide if you're interested in taking the challenge yourself see you soon